Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to show you Sambisari Temple, a 9th century Hindu temple that was buried underground for centuries. Let's go and check it out. Sambisari Temple is located in Parwom Martani, Kalesan, Slemen, in the special region of Yagyakarta. It is about 12 kilometers east of Yagyakarta city and 4 kilometers west of the famous Prambanan Temple complex. The temple was discovered by accident in 1966 by a farmer who was working on his land. He hit a carved stone with his hoe, which turned out to be part of the temple ruins. The archaeological team from Yagyakarta excavated the site and found that the temple was buried about 5 meters underground. They also found a gold plate engraved with the words Om Shivish Tarna, which means the place of Shiva. The temple was restored and opened to the public in 1987. Sambisari Temple is dedicated to Shiva, one of the main gods in Hinduism. The temple complex consists of a main temple and three smaller temples in front of it. The main temple is square-shaped and has four niches on each side. Inside the main temple, there is a Linga Yoni, a symbol of Shiva's creative power. The Linga is a phallic-shaped stone that represents Shiva, and the Yoni is a basin-shaped stone that represents his consort, Parvati. The Linga Yoni is placed on a square pedestal with four small statues of Nandi, the bowl that serves as Shiva's mount. The three smaller temples are called Pravara temples, which means guardian or companion temples. They are also square-shaped and have niches on each side. Each Pravara temple contains a statue of a Hindu deity. The central Pravara temple has a statue of Agastya, a sage who is regarded as the founder of Shaivism, the sect that worships Shiva. The northern Pravara temple has a statue of Ganesha, the elephant-headed god who is the son of Shiva and Parvati. The southern Pravara temple has a statue of Durga, the fierce goddess who is another form of poverty. One of the most interesting features of Sambi Sari Temple is the elaborate carvings on the walls and niches of the temples. The carvings depict various scenes from Hindu mythology, such as the story of Rama and Sita, the story of Krishna and Arjuna, and the story of Bhima and Duryodhana. The carvings also show different aspects of Shiva, such as his dance of destruction, his marriage to Parvati, and his manifestation as Ardhanarishvara the half-male and half-female form. Sambisari Temple is a remarkable example of ancient Javanese art and architecture. It shows the influence of Indian culture on Indonesia during the 9th century, when the Mataram Kingdom ruled over Java and Bali. 
The temple also reveals the mystery of how it was buried by volcanic ash from Mount Merapi, which is still active today. That's all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed learning about Zombie Sari Temple with me. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Thank you.